I think Tash Tires have got a box of insignia here. 2013, they got to 2016. We're doing a headlight box, but before I do, I'm going to show you which one it is. A 50 ignition on. Now, as you can see, the driver's side is working, the passenger side isn't. So, we're going to replace the bulb. Now, to do these, it's quite tricky and it's a bit of a tight spot. But nothing's impossible. So, first, what you do, you remove this. As you see, you remove that and then you've got a cover on the back here. Which you remove. That's the cover. On the back here, you see there's a, uh, if you could see uh, properly, I don't know if you can or not, but on the back of the light, if there's a, there's a, there's a plug for it. What you do with the plug, you twist it to your left. You twist it to your left, I would say, no, to, to your right, and then pull the bulb out. Complete unit comes out. Here it is. Now, the only way the bulb would go in, if you see the, if you see the lug here, right? That's how the bulb needs to go back on, so. That's how it needs to go back on. Now we're gonna get the new one out, which is in here. Right, that's the bulb to put it back in. That's the holder. Now that's the only way it would go back in, so we put it back and push it back in. And then we slot it back into the hole, which is here, as you would see. If you come around to the camera, please. If you look inside here, so you've got to be very careful how you plug it back in. Once it's in there, all you then do is line it up and then turn it to your le uh, to your right or to your left, either one. Yep, that's all done. So we're just going to check see if it's working now. Again, as you can see now, both of them are working. That's all you got to do on yours as well. If there's anything else you want to know, let us know and then we'll try helping you out. And thanks for watching our channel. Goodbye.